Tonight, we're learning more about the bicyclist who was killed by a hit-and-run driver last night. It happened in northwest Fort Wayne in the 13,000 block of Hand Road. News Channel 15's Angelica Robinson talked with friends of Nick Maruk. She joins us now with what they had to say. Heather and Brett, friends and family are devastated by the loss of 24-year-old Nick Maruk. They say he was an easygoing, charismatic person who loved to make people laugh, and he enjoyed spending time with those closest to him. Saturday, Nick Maruk was making plans for Halloween. He texted Blake Colburn, a friend since middle school. He wanted to come hang out with me, uh, but I wasn't at the house. And uh, he said, oh, well, shoot, you know, maybe another time. Colburn never thought Halloween would be the last time they'd have the chance. It's a conversation that haunts him. I, I mean, hindsight, I wish I would have took the time to go hang out with him one more time. Maruk was riding his bike in the 13,000 block of Hand Road. He lived nearby, his friends say. And according to his high school friend, Megan Garvison, riding his bike wasn't something he did often. I know every once in a while we'd go on a bike ride if, you know, his car wasn't working or something. So that could have been the case. But last night, authorities say someone hit him and then drove off. A little bit later, witnesses say a second vehicle stopped picked up the bicycle, then left. It just really made me sad to think about that somebody would leave him there and drive past and even steal his bike. It's just horrible. It's sad to think about him laying there like that. Now all they can do is hope the person responsible admits to what happened. May God bless your soul. I, I hope you get on the right track. I hope you value life more than you clearly do. I just, I hope God steers you in the right direction. The Allen County Sheriff's Department wants your help. If you know anything about the hit and run or the theft of the bike, you're asked to call the Sheriff's Department. Angelica Robinson, News Channel 15.